Hi Scorpio, this is Sandy Couture and I am here doing the astrological tarot reading for the sign of Scorpio for the month of November, no, I'm sorry, October 2021. Um, right now we have, or at least starting tomorrow, we will be, be experiencing seven planets in retrograde. Now, retrograding planets, everybody gets a little afraid of them, but that is not the case. When planets are retrograde, especially Mercury, it's time for breakthroughs, it's time for balance, it's time for second chances, um, it's time for correcting mistakes. I like that one. Um, so not only will Mercury, starting tomorrow, the 27th of October, go retrograde, but we have six outer planets, which are the planets of personal transformation going retrograde also. So it's going to be an interesting at least first two to three weeks here. Um, on October 6th, Pluto, the planet of transformation, does go um, direct, which will help us to move forward a little bit more easily. And then mid-month, the 17th and 18th, um, Mercury and Jupiter, planet of expansion, will also go direct. So the first three weeks in this sign, in the sign of Libra, is all about balance, second chances, breakthroughs, re-examining desires, and um, it's not necessarily a time to move forward, but it's a time to get all your ducks in a row, so to speak, and to be in balance with it and be in, for some reason, the word this month comes up forgiveness for you, uh, Scorpio. So anyway, the first card that I pulled for you is the Four of Wands. Wands is a fire um, card. It's an action card. And fours are always about well-being. It's about good memories, how life was. And you may be remembering all of how life was right now because of all of the retrograded planets you're reviewing. And that review is good. It should make you feel good. It should make you feel loved and um, happy. Um, however, there is a change coming because a challenge or surprise card um, has the tower and the tower looks really bad. There are people falling to the ground and it's exploding, but it's really about shifting, shifting yourself, breakthroughs. There you go with all of those retrograde planets. I believe there's going to be a breakthrough happening for you, Scorpio. And sometimes breakthroughs and change are not easy, but in my life experience, they've always led to the best possible outcome for me and for my soul growth. The process card is to use your intellect. You're going to actually, um, with all of this retrograding, reviewing and breakthroughing and um, second chances, you're going to come up with a really fabulous uh, shift intellectually or idea or concept um, that's going to be a, a big mover for you towards the end of the month. And actually the most likely outcome card is a fabulous most likely outcome card. It's the 10 of pentacles. Tens are about money and a simple meaning for this card is you're gonna have more money than you know what to do with. Maybe a raise, maybe you'll win the lotto, but it's also about paying it forward and using everything that you have a accumulated your your what your knowledge your wisdom in this lifetime and passing it to others so um i hope you enjoyed that reading for you scorpio it sounds like you've got a wonderful interesting month ahead of you and i know that the outcomes will be positive especially with that last outcome card thank you so much for watching and see you next month